Hey Harry Potter fans, Peter Kenneth here. Welcome back to the Potter Collector channel where we are a community of collectors. Today is Tuesday, which means it is a Potter Review Tuesday where I review a Harry Potter related product for you guys to check out. We are going to be looking at the Hogwarts Express Musical Globe by the Bradford Exchange. The Bradford Exchange provided me with this globe but all opinions in this review are my own. Inside of the cardboard box is this protection charm around the globe, and there is a note. Oh my cow, this is beautiful handwriting. Wait, is this printed? Wow, check that handwriting out. Dear Peter, in the following box, you'll find a Journey to Hogwarts Glitter Globe. I hope you love the Glitter Globe as much as we do, and I look forward to watching your video and hearing what you think. Enjoy. The globe comes with a certificate of authenticity from the Bradford Exchange, which explains that there are only 295 globes made per day, and this one appears to be 3,593. Now let's get into the main event. This is the first time I'm seeing one of these in person. <gasps> it's already all globey, and it just, that is, this, this, this took my breath away. Whoa, look, I mean, who doesn't love a snow globe? And then to see Hogwarts inside with snow fluttering around it. The globe itself is so beautiful. I have not even seen the base yet, which I know is hand painted and has some other fun things on it. All right, the big reveal. Ooh, on the back it says platform nine and three quarters, King's Cross. Oh, I also see a raven and a badger. We have a lion and a snake on the other side. So that's all four of the houses represented. And then the Hogwarts Express. It looks like it has a plug. Oh, it takes batteries or a plug. Let's see, I hope there are batteries in here because I don't have any batteries. Let's see if it turns on. <gasps> Woo! Look at that. And it lights up too so we can see how it glows. You can see the bottom is numbered. So this particular globe is 3,593. Wow, this is really cool. Oh, nice. You don't have to have the music on, which is really nice. If you turn the switch halfway, it turns the lights and the Hogwarts Express on. But then if you switch it all the way, the music turns on. But you can still have the Hogwarts Express going and the globe glowing without the music playing, which is very convenient. Looks like you can also purchase a adapter so that you don't have to use batteries. So you could have this on all the time without having to worry that the batteries will die on you. The globe plays the beautiful music we all know by John Williams, Edwig's theme. Each globe is hand painted. On the back is that platform nine and three quarters logo, as well as the raven and the badger. This is really, really beautiful. Look at the magic! This is a very cool piece of Harry Potter merchandise. My favorite part is the globe on top which has Hogwarts and the snow glittering around it. The base is beautiful. It has rock work and trees. Of course, that bridge that we all know, the Hogwarts Express. Each animal from each house represented. I love the Hogwarts Express going around the globe, going into a tunnel and coming out of a tunnel. How cool is that? Love it, love it, love it. It's very heavy. It's a very substantial piece and also a little bit bigger than I was expecting. So that's a, that's a plus as well. Because we have the Hogwarts motto down here, never tickle a sleeping dragon, I think the only thing I would have changed besides the fact that a raven is represented, which is a lot of Harry Potter merchandise, I would have rather seen the Hogwarts crest in here instead of the golden trio. Maybe even carved into the stone and rock work instead of that picture of the trio. It's not a bad thing. The trio is the obvious choice and I think it's still a beautiful, beautiful piece of Harry Potter merchandise, a beautiful globe. But for my personal taste, I would have rather seen the Hogwarts crest on this side to mimic the platform nine and three quarters symbol on the back. I love the color palette, the color choices, the grays of the stonework, 
the the mountain colors and the trees and even the the animals on the back kind of look like wood I love that design choice and also the lion and the snake on the front which blend into the stonework well this is the journey to Hogwarts illuminated glitter globe by the Bradford exchange down below is a link to where you can purchase this direct from the Bradford exchange and they will send you one of these globes that looks like it is directly from the wizarding world. If you have any questions about Harry Potter, Harry Potter collecting, this globe right here, please leave a comment below. I will do my best to get back to you. You can also email me, thepottercollector at gmail.com or find me on Instagram at thepottercollector. Now it is time to like, comment, subscribe, and until next time, keep collecting. Thank you so much for watching. If you're new here, welcome. You can subscribe right up here. You can also look at some previously posted content down here. If you have any questions about Harry Potter books or collecting, please feel free to contact me. I'm always happy to help. But for now, I must go. See you next time. Whoa, where'd he go?